This is Twit. I went full millennial and I brought an app to the arena called Vlog It. Oh. It sounds exactly like what you think it does. It helps you put together videos and upload them to YouTube. I haven't, I haven't actually tried uploading anything to YouTube yet, but I needed an app that I could just use to put some darn music to some video so I could send it to my friends or maybe post it to Instagram. And I found an app that lets me do that and just that and easily. So this is Vlog It. So this is Vlog It. Um, Vlog It is, it's gonna remind you a lot of YouTube. Uh, there's a lot of red in it. This is a silly little video that I made the other day, but I'm not gonna show that to you yet. First, <laughs> I, first I'm gonna make a video and I'm gonna show you that I am going to make a video of myself. I'm making a video of myself. All right. How, how millennial how, of you. How millennial of me. Pouty um, face, pouty face. <laughs> so I just added that. And so you can get a quick look at the interface. It will handle those vertical, those awful vertical. Listen. Oh, this geez. is how the millennials communicate with each other through vertical video <laughs> with blurry backgrounds on the back, which by the way, if you go into the settings, you can adjust all this. So I'll show you the sh settings. I'll show you the settings in a second. Well, I, I appreciate um, that they do something with all that, that wasted space at least. Well, the wasted space is not for naught. Um, the wasted space is supposed to act as a timeline actually when you have multiple videos. So all your videos will show up down here. Um, let's see if I can actually show you. So this is how the timeline looks like on a video. Um, you can add text as you need it. Put some art deco. Oh, look at that. Look at that transition. You could put that yeah. in there. Wow. Ooh, look at that. I can make my own logo. Oh, look at that cool one. You um, could be an influencer, Flo. I could be an influencer. Uh, you can add stickers if you need to. Um, mm -hmm. Deal with it. Play some deal with the glasses <laughs> if you need to. You can adjust the audio as you need. Now, I like this because so I added like a little, um, I added a little vaporwave track on top of here. And the track is not as long as the video, but you can see it in relation to the rest of your timeline. Um, and you can actually individually set the volume if you need it. You could you could set if it fades in or fades out. Um, you could trim it if you need to and just easily do it from here. And it's nice and easy. There's different effects that you can um, apply. So if here's a button zipper effect, if I needed to add that to something, which I'm not going to, it's fine. We don't need sound effects or voiceover if you want to add. Yes, this is me 20 uh, years ago. No, I'm I don't slow. know. You know, whenever they do those record scratches. Anyway, I was <laughs> trying something there. Um, there's also a library, so you can toss in photos if you need to with a Ken Burns effect, which is an option mm -hmm. on here, by the way. Mm -hmm. you got to have a Ken Burns effect. Gotta. Um, you can also set the transitions. And the nice thing about this is you can test the transitions on here and then apply them all at once by just hitting this little, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, guys. The brightness was up too much on there. There's a little apply all button here in the corner. So What's I, in the box, Flo? What's in the box? Well, it's funny oh. you should ask what's in the actual <laughs> box. So here's a little video I made. The media is down. I put a little, it's, <laughs> it's, a, it's a Google Home Max. I'm just oh. going to tell you. Yeah, it's a Google Home Max. Spoil the I ending. I can adjust the speed to make it just go really fast too. So that we can. Oh, so like a time lapse. Move this a little faster. Of course, I need to turn off the audio of me talking <laughs> because then it sounds like little little squeaky mice. And uh, you can apply a little filter too if you wanted. So, and this is all the stuff that comes for free with it. Um, I'm actually not as familiar with what you can unlock, um, but there are settings. So you can choose, like I said, the Ken Burns effect, video resolution, background, that sort of thing. So, vlog nice. it. Log and it. it's called Vlog It. One word. V Vlog It. Vlog It. It's a free a video editor it. made for vloggers. And the one thing that they try to use to kind of like entice people is the fact that they actually worked with YouTubers to create oh. this app. So the idea was to create an app for actual YouTubers. Who yeah, and the features this. that they want at the yeah. push of a button, easy, not a bunch of extra stuff. Yeah. 
And um, it's backed cool. by a company called Filmora, from what I understand. 